estate to real estate. It's Money Matters with Dino. Explain to everybody listening right now, what is uh, franchise and distribution law? Franchise distribution law basically um, talks about, uh, it's a new model that was developed uh, to allow expansion of a brand. So typically, uh, in the old days, uh, you were able to uh, borrow money to uh, expand your business, uh, or you were able to issue shares uh, through SEC and uh, bring in new money. Franchise basically allows you to um, allow your uh, business model to be used by others as independent contractors. Uh, you basically you give them a license to conduct business and follow protocol, uh, and that way the franchisor who's come up with a good model is allowed to expand by allowing third parties, investors, to uh, license in uh, to expand the franchisor's model. So instead of going out and borrow a lot of money uh, to do it in-house, you basically allow the new investors to come in and uh, copy your business uh, and pay you a percentage of your gross sales. Uh, so you make money from their efforts. They take the risk to start the business uh, at the cost that the franchisor discloses what it costs. So that way, um, people who want to get into their business uh, are allowed to uh, copy you uh, and enter into a contract with you. So that's basically a franchise that's governed by the uh, federal rules and is governed by state rules, uh, the 14 registered states that require you to specially register yourself before selling franchises. But the, generally speaking, the laws uh, sort of mimic the SEC rules. Mm -hmm. In other words, there's disclosure requirements, so the investor needs to understand what they're getting into, what are the risks, and what are the uh, obligations, and what are the terms, conditions. 